Pediatric Neurology Last Minute Flash Cards An 18 months old turns cyanotic with a brief loss of consciousness that occurred during a temper tantrum. This is a case of breath holding spells. The key words is cyanosis, brief loss of consciousness during anger or temper tantrum. The treatment is reassurance. And these episodes or these spells are not harmful. Acknowledge the fear of parents and reassure them. Breath holding spells can be associated with iron deficiency anemia. Check for iron deficiency if there is a risk factor, for example, excessive consumption of whole milk, pica, or pallor. A previously healthy 16 months old boy has 60 seconds generalized seizure in the setting of febrile illness, not involving the CNS, and now is acting normal. Simple febrile seizure. Recurrence risk after first simple febrile seizure is approximately 30%. The risk of developing epilepsy in children with simple febrile seizure is about 2%. Remember, simple febrile seizure, brief, generalized, less than 15 minutes, does not recur within 24 hours, and febrile illness not involving the central nervous system, for example, not associated with meningitis. A previously healthy 16 months old boy has had two febrile seizures in the last 24 hours, and the infant is now acting normal. Complex febrile seizures. Remember, complex febrile seizures can be focal, but in case of simple febrile is generalized, complex is prolonged more than 15 minutes, simple febrile is less than 15 minutes, Complex recurs within 24 hours of febrile illness, but simple only once within 24 hours. History of diarrhea followed by progressive ascending weakness and loss of deep tendon reflexes with CSF showing elevated protein. Guambari syndrome or acute inflammatory demyelinating polyradiculoneuropathy. Be familiar with the new name. The key words here, progressive ascending muscle weakness preceded one or two weeks by upper respiratory tract infection or diarrhea. Loss of deep tendon reflexes like knee reflexes. This is a key word, very important. And CSF will show elevated protein is well known as cytoalbumin dissociation, which is normal cells with high protein in CSF. Best next step is to give IVIG intravenous immunoglobulin in order to shorten the hospital length of stay and time to ambulation. An adolescent girl with severe unilateral pain in and around the eye and temporal area feels like an ice pick or hot poker. The pain rapidly peaks within minutes of onset and resolves over next several hours. The headaches are recurrent, sometimes multiple times a day. Over, over a period of 6 to 12 weeks on examination, she has meiosis, lacrimation, conjunctival injection, and rhinorrhea at the same side of the pain. What is the most likely diagnosis? Cluster headache. Cluster headache, key words, severe unilateral pain in and around the eye. Feels like ice pick or hot poker. And on the same side, ipsilateral side, meiosis, lacrimation, conjunctival injection, and rhinorrhea. The best treatment for severe cases of cluster headache, administration of 100% oxygen. Visit lastminutepediatric.com to learn more about last minute flashcard videos. You are able to review these cases in the last minute, review chapter 33 in the third edition. Thank you and good luck in your exam.